Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here for today's video. I want to cover uh, how to register an Israeli domain name and um, I'm going to be relying here upon the uh, this little guide uh, in part prepared by the Israeli Internet Association. Um, the Israeli domain name, we have two top level domains in Israel. One is .co.il, that's the main domain name at TLD for Israeli websites. One thing to know is uh, I've owned uh, danielrosel.co.al for many years now, actually since I made Aliyah, and uh, I would call that co.il, like .co.uk, uh, but the way Israelis pronounce it is .co.il. I once had a very entertaining conversation with my domain registrar trying to get the uh, name servers updated and they could not understand co.il it's there and they started saying co say co so that's how israelis uh, pronounce it so um this uh, is the israeli internet association here has a uh, page and they just mentioned as well there's also .org.il but you need to be a uh, not for profit to qualify for a uh, .org.il domain um the site and all these registrars will enforce that there's actually .muni.il and .gov.il but those are reserved for use by uh government bodies so i personally recommend if you want to buy an israeli domain a .co.il you use one of the accredited registrars of the isoc the isoc being the uh, israeli internet association they're the official body governing uh, the um, assignment of domains and other things to do with the operation of the internet in Israel. So this is that page, it's called Accredited Registrars. It is fortunately in English as well as Hebrew and there is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It's actually not a huge amount. So you'll find more people than this group of registrars selling Israeli domains. But as I said, I recommend personally buying an Israeli domain name from an official, officially accredited Israeli registrar. Um, I've been using uh, Communical, which the, their website's Galcom for many years, and I'm actually pretty happy with them. I just uh, was in touch with them to get a receipt for my tax return, which is what made me think of uh, recording this video. And yeah, their support was really responsive. I mean, how much do you need to interact with your domain registrar? I pay my I pay my domain registrar fee once a year. They send me a receipt. I put that in my tax return. I keep the name servers going and I've had no problems uh, with them. So I'm just going to show you their website. It's galcom, uh, G-A-L-C-O-M-M dot C-O dot I-L. Ironically, as I record this video, my internet is pretty pretty lousy. So this is Galcom and you can search for a, they'll also sell you regular domains like .coms, but the default is set to uh, co.il, an Israeli domain. How much do these cost? So I got a couple of price offers from the list of official registrars. This is domain.li, uh, which is il backwards for some reason uh they're quoting uh 96 shackles a month i just put in a junk domain i put in jerusalem is dot cool dot co dot el because i figured no one would have registered that because jerusalem just isn't cool that was a joke but uh this one is uh this one is free and it's 96 uh shackles a year including vat kolal mam and it's 82 shackles a year before mam um, I also got a quote from Galcom for Jerusalem is really cool and that came in at $20.95 per year which I think is probably about the same as 100 NAS. In other words, an Israeli domain name, a .co.al is slightly more expensive than a .com but not by a huge amount, it's by about $10 and this is actually something you'll see in general. Um, I've owned in my, in my day um, Irish domains, .ie uh etc and usually the um country specific tlds are just a little bit more expensive than dot coms and other uh, top level domains or tlds so i think that's really about all there is to know on the topic um again i would recommend if you're thinking of buying about an israeli domain pay this uh, web resource a visit from the israeli internet association they will uh, and uh, buy i would recommend buying from their list of officially accredited registrars because you know you know uh, that they're uh, legitimately um, assigning the um, Israeli TLD and there's 13 of them to choose from. I don't know most of them but I'm familiar with uh, Galcom and I can personally 
and totally independently recommend them as pleasant people to deal with and the price you can expect to pay for your Israeli domain name is approximately $20 give or take per year to keep it uh, updated on the internet. Thank you guys for watching, hope that was helpful and uh, more videos from me will be coming soon.